Well, it always seems that in my car videos, Ford is insufficiently represented. We got a couple of Chryslers, a couple of Chevys, a Honda or two, but never seem to see very many Ford vehicles in any of my videos. So how about a Mercury Grand Marquis? This is my grandfather's 2006 Mercury Grand Marquis. One of the last rear-wheel drive V8 powered cars you can buy in the U.S., if not the last kind of that, other than its uh, sister, the Ford Crown Victoria. Anyway, we're out here at the farm to get the tractor, so I'm going to follow it into town. And I'm going to drive this car for your video watching pleasure. Well, this car's got about all the toys in it. Automatic climate controls, a radio would make you a pizza if you just knew what buttons to push. See how she sounds when we fire her up here. Listen. Look at that. All kinds of automated gizmos on this thing. 23.6 mile per gallon. Let's see what she sounds like when she started up. Turn the fan down here. Got an air compressor running. Must have a level suspension on it, an air suspension. What power? Quiet though, once it gets started. Pretty darn quiet. Well, there goes the tractor. So I have to follow it out. Well, here we are on the highway. This is an amazing car. I haven't driven one of these in a long time. They're every bit as good as I remember. I know there are some people don't like Ford out there, but I've certainly got nothing against them. It's a pretty sweet ride. Plenty of power if you need it, too. Okay. Now that isn't going to work. I hate cars that don't take no seat belts for an answer. <laughs> well, it did finally decide to quit complaining about the seat belts while I was going down the road. Smart car. Would have hated for this to get personal. <laughs>